So if I was going to be graphing this, I know breaking this up into 5 thirds, that's kind of going around the circle quite a bit. So what I can do is I'm going to rewrite this. Now, the last example was kind of easy to break it up into 2 pi, right? Because 2 pi plus 2 pi plus pi would equal 5 pi. But what we need to understand is if we're talking about thirds, then 2 pi is equal to what? How many pi's over 3 is equal to 2 pi? 6, right? Because 6 divided by 3 is 2. So therefore, I need to break this fraction up into 6 pi over 3's. Well, again, guys, remember, adding fractions, you're just adding the numerator. So it's 6 pi over 3 plus 6 pi over 3 plus 3 pi over 3, which is really just pi, right? Yes. Because what's 6 divided by 3? 2 pi. Well, 2 pi is, remember, that, remember what I did over there? 2 pi is just a revolution around the circle. Does that make sense? So, but, so these are all just redundants. And really, 3 divided by 3 goes to pi. I sh no. Yeah. So that's just going to leave me with pi. So I, wait a how did I? Oh, you know what? I'm, obviously, 15 divided by 3 is 5. I just picked a stupid problem to do.